Herman Katz! You sick son of a bitch! It's been a while since the last fight, hasn't it, Hermit Cat? But now I own you! I own you! You're mine now! But you know what? Love's pink lemonade. Dude, same. Same. There's nothing wrong with that. Pink lemonade is amazing. But I will fight you today in Heavenly Towers, floor 30. I still- I own him right now. He's mine. However, recently, Baby Boy came home. Baby Boy is my D'Artagnan. Uh, I got him in the last like, couple of months and I was overjoyed. It's been a, a good, strong year of searching for him, but Baby Boy has come home. There's still D'Artagnan still left, but um, you know what? Baby Boy came home and also he brought a friend. Shadow Gal, otherwise known as Diabolical Gal. Alternate Dimension Gal from the Darkness Timeline. Uh, already sounds cool. Six power at any cost. And then he evolves into Diabolical Gal, who by the way, over the top, amazing, appears only to those who have known true despair. Massive damage versus non-attribute enemies, such as Hermit Cats. And it freezes the enemies briefly as well, which is going to be very valuable in this round here. Now you can solo with D'Artagnan Cat, you can solo with Shadow Gal. But what if we use both? And if you guys want a video on Heavenly Towers Floor 30 that isn't me, you know, using these really limited rare Ubers, then go check out my other video no, on Heavenly no, Towers no, no. Floor 30 that I did, so where I crushed Hermit Cat, I got him. Right, However, I wasn't exactly not Uber carried, but at the same time, Shishalan is Bay. Second favorite Luga, but Bay. Let's get a show on the road right now. It's my squad here. Very weird squad. Top row is just for like an increase in attack damage, right? There he is. Punch, punch, punch. Unit attack up. It was the only medium attack up. I could. We got one meat shield here. I guess two in case we were like really struggling. We have two fast boys. Crazy Raph Cat. I don't have the Lion Cat just yet. I don't have the true form just yet. But he is like level 28. And then we have Lil Lion Cat. Only level 18 plus 12. So, I don't know. This is going to be very, very... This is gonna be bad, but to really help me out here I'm gonna be using a rich cat because if you're serving up rich cats This is the time to use them. This is when you want to use the rich cats right now floor 30 Let the battle begin. It's been a very long while Since I did this one fingers crossed it all goes well. I also apologize in advance for any like sniffles I'm very ill. I'm a sick boy, but we're gonna slow him down here with our meat shields. Nice and slowly. Each time he attacks is buying us precious time here, if we just time it correctly. Now, fortunately, this one, we don't have to use our brain as much, which is great news. Do this. Yo, yo, his range is disgusting. Anyways, we can afford Shadow Gal now. Make sure stuff is in front of Shadow Gal at all times. He got hits. Baby boy got hits. Can he get hit by wave attacks? No, he can't. He just got hit because, like, I was very... Stupid in terms of my summoning. We still have like time out the meat shields here. Luckily, Camel Cat's pretty goddamn fast, so we just keep on summoning Camel Cat here. I think we should be okay. All right, the Tunnel got hit once. We should spam out Camel Cat. Don't mess us up, mate, please. But eventually, he will die and we'll be victorious and we can move on to like better stuff here. Like, I, I really want to try out and do full 30 to floor 40. It has been my dream ever since lots of people watched my other video. Uh, D'Artagnan's dead. By the way, and the idea is to keep the camel. Mm. The idea is to keep the the giraffe cat oh, and the lion it. cat in he front. He said the name right. He of course, said you can't really giraffe, do that flower, not camel. Oh my cat. god, he's learning. He finally said it. <laughs> Shadow Gal's dead. No. No. Please, mercy. Kill him. Oh my actual crap. We weren't even that close, honestly. That was a rich cat gone down the drain. What am I doing wrong here? I don't know. <laughs> Sniper cat, please. I watched so many videos on this thinking like, okay, this seems extremely easy, very simple thing to do. Like they make it look so much easier than it actually is. Everyone else had a manic lion cat. You know, maybe that's the hidden strat right there. The idea is to also have enough money for giraffe cat. We weren't timing it properly. We were just spamming out Giraffe Cat whenever we felt like it because I was scared and, and lonely. What's the lonely part got to do with anything? I'm... Look, I'm just sharing, okay? Alright, so we want to like be close to our base before we do anything. Honestly? You know what? Summon both, both boys here. Alright. I just want to spam out the Giraffe Cats whenever I can. It's working okay because we're so close to our base, but I think as soon as we're not close to our base here, that strat might stop working. Crazy Giraffe Cat doesn't have that power to kill 
The snake very- Oh, D'Artagnan Cat's gonna die soon. Thank you. Thank you so much for the knockback and the freeze. It was so valuable for our success. Can we just cheese it? Can we, like, just literally- Oh, no! Don't kill D'Artagnan, please! Okay. D'Artagnan's- Yeah, he's gonna die soon. He's still living. What a beautiful baby boy, man. Holy shit. I love you, D'Artagnan. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I let you down. Shadow Gal, kill him! Kill the dog! Please be dead soon. Oh my- Why? <laughs> oh my god, Shadow Gal! <laughs> Please! Oh my god! Why is this so hard? <laughs> god, I suck so much ass! Alright, we're panicking here a bit. Stop panicking! Why are you panicking so much? He's almost dead. Surely, he is almost dead. The dark Titan keeps getting hit. Yo, stop hitting my baby boy! Please! No! He's dead, okay, we've done it. No, it's okay. All right, no, we've done it. All right, summon everything, who cares? Jesus Christ, it was a lot harder than it should have been, admittedly. Look at that, beautiful, floor 30. I got the trophy again. All right, you get three red tickets there? That's pretty good, that's pretty nice. That's so worth doing every single time it pops up then. If you can do it, if you have the capabilities of doing that on a regular without struggling like me, uh, then by all means, go ahead and do it. But like, look at that, hold on, where's my, where's my trophy? It's golden. Oh, floor 30. We've already done this, but for some reason it didn't really activate, so... You know, it is it is what it is. There's some bugs here and there. I know the Meow medals don't really do anything, but I just, I just love looking at my collection of medals and being like, Hey, I earned that. That was, that was me. I got that. Me and my massive collection of Ubers got that. It was all me. Uber carry scum! This point onwards, I am completely blind. I have not even looked into full 31 and above. I have no idea what to expect here. So let's do full 31 and 32 and then leave it here as a video. And then honestly, because we have to do all these recordings in one day, I'm gonna try my best to do as many floors as possible today. I'm gonna split up into like multiple videos here for you guys and then post them later on next week. Uh, I am busy later on today, so I can't do too many. I just wanna see how many floors I can do within like literally like two hours here. Okay, floor 31. As you can see here, if I click on it, question mark, question mark. Two enemies, just two enemies, really? Seems pretty easy if you ask me. So usually they like spitting out neutral enemies. So anything without a trait or an attribute, they like to spit out at me. Good, because Dark Tenning Cat loves to eat those too. This squad is pretty goddamn killer. It's pretty nice. What makes them more uber carried? We have literally like three limited edition Ubers here. <laughs> so so if you do, if you have them, why not use them, you know? People aren't as lucky and I honestly, my heart goes out to you guys. Um, I do. You guys, I think, honestly, because you aren't as lucky, you become smarter. You have the knowledge to like tackle these, or like at least try to tackle this, um, without these guys, and that makes you so much smarter than than me. So you know what? Well done. You can you can have that. But honestly, I'm kind of relieved that I have these cats. I don't think the molecules in my brain could react fast enough to come up with something smart. Commentating itself is hard. You know, most of the stuff I say is just complete and utter garbage. But you people eat it up, which I I appreciate so much. <laughs> I do try. I try my best. Alright, this squad looks good enough. It's kind of like, hey, I'm ready for like almost everything squad. Kinda. Uh, floor 31, let the battle begin. So Kanga Cat, great for like damage. It can also like slow down red enemies if we have to. Of course, we have a timer for that as well. Uh, we also have Seafarer Cat because he has beautiful hair and also pretty powerful. That's Evil Cat. You're throwing an like, Evil Cat at me? Oh, hell. If I remember correctly, Evil Cat took approximately like 20... 20 minutes to kill. It was a long, winding, and slow, and painful process. And here I am. Oh, it's it's Cow Cat. F Fight from a range here. Okay, so we spam our meat shields, protect Dark Tiny Cat, and hopefully Dark Tiny Cat does enough damage to kill these guys. These are neutral guys, right? These are these are neutral. Please tell me these guys are neutral. Yo, he's already like at low health here. These guys are neutral though, right? I mean, we're killing them. All right, sh uh, oh, we don't have Shadow Gal, we have Normal Gal. Oh, we only have Dark Tending Cat, which is enough, by the way. He's on low health right now. Oh gosh, don't die. Don't, Dark Tending Cat, do not die. Just get back, yeah, 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 just get back. Oh no, why is this so difficult? 
god! Oh my god! Please! Mercy! Small, very cute, adorable, crazed, basic cat left, okay? I'm gonna spam out literally everything else I can in the meantime. Dark Candy Cat must stay alive. If he dies, oh, he's dead. You know what? No, we can do it, okay? We're relying on Baby Boy too much. Yes, he was a godsend. The Ponas lulled to themselves. Thank you, Ponas. All right, we killed the basic cat, which means we can afford everything now, which is great. Even my baby boy is back in the field. He had to rest for a bit, and then he's, he's fine again. Um, why is there so many cow cats popping out right now? What's going on with that situation? That's a little bit crazy, don't you think? Hey, game, could you stop? Stop pouring out the crazed cow cats, please. All right, we, we are killing them like pretty rapidly though. So not too scared. Everything that gets killed is replaced immediately. We can't deploy any more cats here. We're fine. We've won this one. All right. Was I scared? Hell no. Am I ever scared? Have I ever been worried or concerned or scared? Has my voice ever elevated and pitched before in fear? No. None of these things have ever happened before. Ever. You calling me a liar? Smart boy, you're right. Completely fooled you. I lied. Floor 32. I'm just, again, I'm, I'm rambling on. Absolute nonsense. And you're eating it up. Num, 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 num. All right, so we do have a crazed tank cat. Um, I'm hoping, oh, there's two of them. Has there always been two crazed tank cats? Isn't that like a huge problem for me? Has their range always been that good? All right, so the range is incredible. Oh my god. Oh my, he can't even attack. Baby boy can't even attack. The range is so good. Baby boy is dead. What is this? All right, so we need fast, we need fast cats here, okay? Oh no, it's already too difficult. Don't add a moose to the equation here. We're, we're dead, we're so dead. No, we're so utterly dead. There is nothing we can do here. This is silly. This is a bunch of silliness. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. What the <laughs> Dude. What the fuck? All these years of being uber carried. I haven't learned a single thing. I have learned nothing. The only thing I learned was, hey, pop out an uber and you're fine. And now look at me. It's not enough. I need strategy. All right, where's this six of a bitch? I want to find these enemies here. Are they neutral? Please tell me. Why won't you tell me? They're not here. They're not in the enemy encyclopedia, despite them being clearly my enemy. Because the, the craze could be like black enemies, in which case I'm barking up the wrong tree, right? Because there's a little bit of black in there. And that means Dark Canyon Cat is not really in his element in terms of like, you know, doing damage. So, I do have a plan. What we want to do is have some fast boys here. We want some really fast, speedy boys. So how about this? We're going to go ahead and get um, some fast boys. So Craze Draft Cat here. If we can keep them at bay, then long distance attacks will be super good here. Can we search long distance, please? Again, for you battle cats, novices out there, uh, the terminology is a little bit tricky. Long distance doesn't necessarily mean... Long range, even though it says long range for long distance, which is it's so confusing. It has long range, it has AOE effect. Long distance means AOE, which means area of effect. It means it has like a splash effect, right? It attacks one portion of the of the map and then does damage like an explosion. But you don't, it's not really an explosion. Are you getting me so far? It doesn't mean it has good distance though. Yes, there is a good chance it does have good distance because essentially it's it's like firing at a extra part of the map there. So technically it does fire at a better distance than most units because of the long distance and long range. However, that's not a guarantee. Some cats literally have long distance right in front of them. So therefore it only gets a very small amount of area that it does more damage to. It's really complicated. I think um, Lucas himself has made a video on it, uh, explaining it. It's it's super dumb and stupid and I hate it, but <laughs> not the video, uh, the concept of long distance in this game. It's not even that I hate it, it's because it's the wrong, it's the wrong terminology. If they said, hey, AOE, these guys have AOE. Okay, I understand that. That's that's gamer terminology. Long distance means something completely different. I think Dark Tiny Cat can just about hit them from a long distance, but because I'm bad, I can't use him properly there. 
I'm gonna use Shadow Gal. Here's what we're gonna do. Cyberpunk Cat would be amazing here. Why? Long distance. His range is stupid powerful. Um, a lot of people use it to cheese uh, stages and stuff because it's so good and powerful. Um, we might want some fast cats too. Yukimura is a really good fast cat. However, I, I don't want to spend the money on a Yukimura that will do a tiny bit of damage and then die. I don't know if these are black enemies. I'm pretty sure they are traitless, right? We're going to replace... Normal Gao or Shadow Gao. Level 32. Let the battle begin. A rematch. Worst could be the worst. What I might actually just do is... See, the squirrels are always in my way. That's also my problem. Maybe I should have had, like, more meat shields, too. I should definitely have had the, uh, the Matic Cat as well. Because they're faster. They can get there faster. The idea is to, like, prolong the inevitable to the point where we can get a Shadow Gao. And just kill them with Shadow Gao. You know what? No. One of these boys instead. Now, we want to make sure they don't move any further. I think, actually, he's missing them. I think Cyberpunk Cat's already missing them. Yeah, they're not getting slowed down. I think, yeah, he, he's, he's absolutely useless right now. I think we've lost. I hate this game. I hate, I hate this game. We're, we're dead. Oh my god. <laughs> ah! Alright, new strat. Uh, sniper cat. Yes, please. And then, honestly, go in there. So, all we needed was a sniper cat, okay? It's the only thing we're missing there. Sniper cat. Again, straight away. We should have swapped out our normal Moho cat for a craze meat shield. It's faster, it's stronger, it can deal more damage. It'll get to the squirrels faster. Right now, the idea is we want to like try and stop them from progressing towards our base. I just, I hate this. I hate this so much. The squirrels just keep on popping out here. Their range is stupid good. And like, I can't get enough money in time to summon, like his range is too good. He has too much range for his, for his good. It's so hard! I reckon we could- no, we can do this now. Just get back. Dark Tiny Cat keeps moving forwards! No! Don't move forwards anymore! No! Dark Tiny Cat! Don't die! Out the love of God! <laughs> Please! So we've lost this one. Um, we need like a new strat here. Alright, so the new strat right here is I'm gonna go all the way over here. I'm gonna get my- Manic Mohawk cat, replace it with my other cat, and then um, I'm gonna go in with a rich cat this time round. Let the battle begin. <laughs> if your uber carry doesn't work, use a rich cat. You get your uber faster this time round, right? Flawless. Thank you, me. Of course, timing it well also works really well here. Uh, the idea, I guess, is you would learn timing uh, from floor 30, and then with that knowledge of timing, uh, you could actually just nail the stage very easily. Sniper Cat does actually really help here uh, for some of the squirrels and stuff like that. So Shadow Gal, I think, has better range. Or not like range, but like better distance than um, than Dark Tiny Cat. So he won't get hit. Yeah, he's not getting hit here. So Shadow Gal actually like really good. I guess preferably you want him like behind the base. So Shadow Gal, I guess, is your secret here. If you have a Shadow Gal, well done. You've won. In the meantime, I'm going to spam out everything else. I'm, I'm using rich cats here. Yeah, yeah. It's scary hard. It's really hard, man. This stuff is hard. The reward better be worth it. That's all I'm saying. Last stage, I got bricks. The bricks were my was my reward. Please, my the bloody squirrels, dude. I never thought squirrels would be my bane right now in this part of the game. They're getting a little bit too close to my base for my liking here. Oh my god, Dark Tiny Cat just fing dies. Oh my god, no! We're not losing this! We use Rich Cat! No! <laughs> You've got to be kidding me! Show me that HP! I want to be upset when I just narrowly lose. He, they must be close to death. They, surely, they were close to dying there. This is ridiculous. Alright, so I looked up a few things online. Apparently, he is vulnerable to knockbacks because he doesn't count as a boss, okay? We should have worked that one out because he doesn't have like a little like percentage health thing at the very end. That's kind of like how you know they're not bosses maybe, perhaps? I don't know. If they're weak to knockbacks, then... Do you knock back, by the way? Knock back. Well, there you go. We just need knockback uh, characters then. We don't have any experience points, so Sniper the Cat or Sniper the Recruit will be very weak here. However, I just need a knockback effect. What else has some amazing knockback effects? Let's find out. Killer Nekakuma. It's your time to shine. Honestly? It's his time. No, he's too slow, right? 
Apparently a Ruin Cat is not bad here. So let's go ahead and sub uh, Bahama Cat for a Ruin Cat. Knocks back non-metal enemies. Oh, Ultra Land, Pass Land. Please, come here. All right, this squad combined with Rich Cat and Sniper Cat should be good. Is there any, hold on, is there any combos we can use here? Maybe like increase the knockback effect. Knockback effect up medium. So we got a Ruin Cat. We could probably like do Executioner and then also this. Can we, can we do this? Yes, please. It does mean we have to get rid of a few cats here. Shadow Gal worked really well for us. I want to keep Shadow Gal. Baby boy, I love you, but goodbye for now. Uh, we got a Ruined Cat first row. We got these two cats here. We're not going to be using them uh, just because they won't be of any use whatsoever. I think Meat Shielding might be extremely important. So we should remember Meat Shielding is great. So I'm going to put that right here. I think a Cyberpunk Cat can still be a really good cat. If we just like do it appropriately, we should be fine. And with the knockback, we should also be just incredibly fine too. And uh, Cypher the Recruit as well for the knockback. I think this is good. I think we're good. All right, we are gonna try it out without a Rich Cat. And then once we fail, which we will fail, of course, we'll try a Rich Cat and see what happens then, okay? So I want to have you. He has incredible range here. So like we shouldn't stop moving forwards, please. He's moving forwards. You have a sniper in your hand. Snipe them. Snipe them. Oh, the knockback is actually incredible. Okay. Now we can slow them down, right? Yeah, we can slow them down. That's huge. Sniper cat might be murdered here, which is not good. We need him. Uh, we can't summon another one for a long ass time either. You know what? A ruined cat is see what her distance is like. If, if her, like, distance is really good, the knockback might be insanely powerful here. Yo, it's going really well so far. Oh, okay, never never mind. Okay, you know what an ultra land He's sitting in the base here punch him. He has knocked back as well and a slight freeze effect, too So he's great again. Just meet you up uh, Let ultra land Charge up his thing ultra land anytime now my, my dudes, please Okay, that's a good punch that was like critical that was a really good punch. We need that punch. Thank God for the punch. All right, we're doing well. Oh, I'm feeling it. Kill the moose, please. The moose has to die next. Oh, okay. There's two moose now. Oh God, Ultra Land's dead. The base is being murdered, please. Someone stop them. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God, I hate this. It's so hard. <laughs> You know what? I'm gonna end it here, guys. Uh, to be continued. Bum, 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 bum. Hope you enjoyed this. Uh, I will have some more Heavenly Towers this week. I hope you enjoy that too. And I'll see you guys... Always. I'm always watching you. That's right, I've hacked your webcam. I'm seeing you through the web- You don't have a webcam? Fuck. Um... I have drones. That's right, I have drones watching you from far. Far away outside the window. And video. We don't have much in terms of tickets. That's okay, that's fine. You, 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 you. you.